amazing. Um, and thank you very much for your for your time here this morning. It's it's an absolute privilege and honour for me to be visiting here at Prime Vision and the International Material Management College as part of a tour that I'm doing in Nepal of Hospitality Management Colleges. And firstly, uh, just the welcome, the warmth of welcome and the efforts that you see young students and faculty delivering to ensure that their students get a, a great experience is really heartwarming to me. Um, my, my name, as I said, is Margaret Curran and I am head of SK's operations for the South Asia region. And the Scottish Qualifications Authority is Scotland's national awarding certification and regulatory body. We are supported and sponsored by the Scottish Government, so we are a government agency. And as part of our role, we have international engagement and work with countries, some of the 30 countries around the world, to deliver a variety of qualifications. And one of the most important aspects of my role is to ensure the standards, to ensure the quality assurance standards are being met by each and every one of our partners because we are responsible for providing the external quality assurance which is to the Scottish national standard and then issuing the certificates. So our name and reputation is with every international approved centre that we have. So that's vitally important as a government body that we are very careful and selective in who we work with to ensure those standards. I think also um, very important for me to say that I think nowadays young people have a huge choice of qualifications and programmes of study. But how do we ensure that the students are going to get the right quality of programme, the credibility of certificates that will be recognised and will enable and empower them to move into the workplace and on to the next steps of their either education or professional career. And it's, it's quite simple really. I think we, as I say, in Scotland have been working for some 100 years establishing the Scottish education system, providing qualifications, developing qualifications, quality assurance, developing quality assurance systems. We also, as a body, we work with other international governments to support them in their work and their aspirations for further developing their own education systems. Not to export a Scottish system, but to work with, to listen, to learn, to help them build their own systems to ensure kind of quality infrastructure and framework of systems for qualifications and certification. So we have worked around the world doing that as well as approving international uh, centres. And I think also one of the things that strikes me in my time, and I am delighted to be able to travel around the country and see firsthand what students are interested in, what are their goals, what's their own vision for the future. This is so important. This is the future of our countries here. And the future of our countries is we, we know, I, I know in Nepal that many students want to travel out, want to experience, want to earn money, to return money home. They want to see the world as many young people do. But if we're providing them with the right qualifications that are internationally recognized certificates, that will ensure that those people are going with the skill set and the confidence in themselves and their certificates that they will know the right places and be guided to go to the right places to work, to seek further study. And very importantly, their experiences out with the country informs them as young people because many will return home. Many will return home to start up in businesses to lead institutions, to develop their own management and professional careers in the country. And 
we want them to start in a capable way. So the building blocks start here. The building blocks start in the college here. And the management team have been telling me about the work that they do with students in terms of the plus two program that they do in management and integrate that as it's added into their advanced diploma in hospitality management. Now, the, the program of advanced diploma in hospitality management that the students do here is a comprehensive program that will ensure that students are certificated and have knowledge and skills about the full range and extent of the hospitality industry. It's not a quick fix that you can do in a few short months because the hospitality industry is diverse, it's complex and there are many aspects of it. So having a proper advanced diploma program over 15 months will expose them to all the different elements of the program to identify what might be their own areas of passion, interest that they might wish to pursue going down. But it will equip them, equip them with the skills and the knowledge because the practical skills that are built in are essential. And this is something else that I think is so important in, if you like, separating out those who are good at what they do and those who want to maybe take shortcuts, is the investment that colleges have to make in their own infrastructure, in professional kitchens, in housekeeping stations, in mock restaurants and bar setups. This is more than just ordinary classrooms. This is a commitment and a real life experience and what it would be like in the actual industry sector itself. So that combination of the practical and the theoretical knowledge combined then with the essential six months internship really does equip them with that experience and that knowledge that will allow them then to decide on their own next steps. Our, our partnership, the partnership between SQA and LCCI has been some nine years now, nine years duration. So I've been very fortunate to come to the PAL on several occasions, meet with and talk with uh, hoteliers from different hotels to understand what they're looking for in their staff, the Chambers of Commerce, um, the British Embassy, um, to understand the education sector as a whole, because we also have had an involvement in a uh, publication a few years back on the education sector in Nepal. And uh, we were very honoured at the time to be invited by the uh, British Ambassador to do a presentation on our work with LCCI at the launch of that education report. So we, as an organisation, SQA, look at it holistically. We have a very important partnership with LCCI, but I am interested in the development of education in the country as a whole and how best that we can work with quality partners to provide opportunities for young people. And the, the tourism and hospitality industry is one of the most important sectors in the country. And as we come out of a pandemic, which everybody in the world has been affected by, there is a, a pent-up demand. People have not been able to travel for some two years. They have missed their holidays. They have been looking, they've been researching, they've been dreaming. And now, you know, in the coming years, I think tourism is going to continue to grow and flourish as well. And it needs skilled young people who will come not only with their specialist skills, but the time that they will have here in Prime Vision is nurturing so many other very important skills that the young people themselves don't even appreciate that they're going to develop. Their communication skills, their teamwork skills, their problem-solving skills, their interpersonal skills, 
All of these skills are combining with their industry-specific skills to grow them as a person, to help them as a person in their own personal journey. Uh, and I'm so thrilled and honoured, as I say, to come here and meet with young students and to see the work that Prime Vision are, are doing to support that. And we chatting to the management team as well with their own experience in the hospitality sector and the credibility that they and you as the faculty teams bring to them in ensuring the standard of the standards of the programme that are met. LCCI do an amazing job of ensuring the resources are there, the support is there, the internal quality assurance mechanisms are there. And I know this because we monitor this in Scotland because we also externally quality assure this. And we have to do it to the Scottish national standards. But the standards that are being delivered here by the LCCI team are nothing short of excellent at every level and I have complete confidence and faith in those standards being applied in each one of the party sites to ensure the best possible experience for the students because at the end of the day the bottom line is the bottom line is this is about our students this is about the experience of those young people about their futures and we have a responsibility and a duty of care to ensure that we do our very best for them. So, continued success. I knew the first batch are, are due to do the final exams in the coming days. I'm sure they are so prepared and ready to take their next steps into the attention. And thank you all for your efforts and your hard work because I come from an academic background, so I too have been a lecturer. My area was actually in tourism, tourism and business management. So I understand the industry, I understand the sector, I know how difficult it is, and how hard it is for faculty staff to nurture, to support, to encourage, to sometimes have to support students to ensure that you bring out the best for them. So many thanks for all your endeavours and to continue success in the future. Thank you. Diploma program, advanced diploma, is for. You for, say, if the 
सो डिप्लोमा प्रोग्राम जो छ महिनाको डिप्लोमा प्रोग्राम र एडभान्स डिप्लोमा प्रोग्राम बिचमा चाहिँ धेरै ठुलो अन्तर भएको छ किनभने जस्तो भोलिको दिनमा विद्यार्थीहरूले एकाडेमिकली बेसिस पढ्नु पर्दाखेरि पनि अथवा बिएचएमा जान अध्ययन गर्न जाँदाखेरि पनि उसको एडभान्स डिप्लोमा प्रोग्राम चाहिँ उसलाई डाइरेक्ट क्रेडिट ट्रान्सफरको उपलब्ध गराउँछ भने डिप्लोमा इन होटल म्यानेजमेन्ट पढेको विद्यार्थीहरूलाई चाहिँ क्रेडिट ट्रान्सफरको सुविधा हुँदैन यो कुराको अन्तर छ भारतमा केही डिप्लोमा प्रोग्राम्सहरू पनि छन् केही प्लस टू प्रोग्राम्सहरू पनि छन् सिटी बिडियोमा सञ्चालन हुने धारणा नभए पनि तपाईँको सिटी बिडियोले पनि होटल म्यानेजमेन्ट सञ्चालन गरिरहेको प्रोग्रामहरू थियो त्यो भन्दा फरक एडभान्स डिप्लोमा किन हो भन्दाखेरि डिओ सर्टिफिकेसन गर्दैछौँ भन्ने कुरा चाहिँ महत्त्वपूर्ण रहेको छ 